but Claudia Sosnowska had seven points and ten rebounds in that clutch win over Hong Kong to land up here. She starts underneath. Ali Z starts with the cookie up top. It's on Kyle Montgomery, a.k.a. the voice in your ear. Kostanek will start the ball for the possession. Ball movement, I should say. And uh, she ends it, it too. Kostanek checks out. Monovic is in. She can shoot that thing. And she proved doing group play. Down low to Bookstra. That one wiped away. So Poland come in, shoot 60% from one out of group play, 24% from two. Nice day, Streisand. Up and in. Out of bounds. Netherlands numbers look pretty good. Average 17 points per game. Possession of Poland. Did not shoot it great from deep. 14% from long range, 50% from inside the arc. Oh, that went through the legs of Ziemborska. Betfield will come away with it. Betfield on the move, drops it off to Yorisma. Yorisma, patient. Patient. Hit the brakes and got the easy score. Marovic turns around. Wait a minute. She gets called for the wall. Call for the wall. Two two game. First minute. Bootstra making a move. Bootstra kind of mishandled that dribble drive. Sanzanow's gonna lead the score. Swings it over. She imports good to Kostanek to Sanzanowska. Back to Ali C. Peace out. Straight to the crib as Poland takes the lead. Miss from Yoritsma. Tipped away. Sosnowska up top. Ali Z hands it off. Kostanek, not that time. As Dreesen will get it clear. The top bucket getter for this Orange Lions team. Dreesen will misfire left. Got a whistle underneath. I believe that'll be called on Poland. Well, I was wrong. The scoreboard says foul on Netherlands, so each team with a foul apiece. Sosnowska starts it over to Shea Borska. Shea and Borska. Quick move, got to finish those. A little strong on the layup. Lois Lane. Oh, Jason gets called for the travel. It's been a little bit of an issue for her here in Hong Kong. Just moving a little bit too quickly. Kostanek. Kostanek, like Sonic, fast to the rim. 4-2. Bootstra, look at the arc on that one. It comes up abbreviate. Inside, Sostowska, tough move. Will draw the foul, the former world number one, up to the line to shoot one. Averaging 5.7 per throughout this tournament. 70% inside the arc. And four or five at the strike. Make that five of six now. As Poland lead it by three. Baseline. Yuritsma, wait a minute. She stepped on the line. It's going to turn it over. So the Netherlands. Similar to the game against Chile. They didn't start off out of the gate so fast. And they had to climb back in and get that win. Only a three-point difference right now, so a lot of game to be played. No good. Stroke one stroke in that time for Costana. Now, Costanek defending. Too aggressive that time. 
Second foul. Now that's it. Great ball stickers. Same on final number two. Azerbaijan waiting on the winner. There's a ticket to Paris is at stake. Yoritz by the drive. These goals ain't loyal. You hear it in the background. These goes on the Marovic for two. Poland seven, Netherlands two. Dreesen goes to the spindle, falling away. Tough shot. Here comes Poland. Marovic fresh, fresh off that two piece. She'll get it over to Zimborska. Zimborska. Falling away. Misses it. Sosnowska. Definite foul there. A lot of contact as she will now shoot one. It is time for a media timeout as the Netherlands look to regroup the defending European champions on their heels a little bit at the start of this one. Here's some of the action so far. They haven't got many easy looks. So tough defense being played by Poland. Shimborska getting free for the easy layup. Kastanek has obviously had her fingerprints on this game so far. And Sosnowska is so strong on the glass. So Sosnowska not only just averaging 5.7 points, averaging 5.7 rebounds as well. So she's a walking double five, and she will cash in the free throw. We got an A2 contest. There's a foul on Poland. Three fouls per team. Six point advantage for the Poles. See if Netherlands can turn it up. Yoritzma with six more to go on the shot clock. There's Polstra getting to work in the post office. Quick ball movement here from Poland. Kostanek to the baseline. Lost her footing. And out of bounds. It'll be Netherlands ball. Bootstra, all oh, gets called for the offensive foul. Offensive foul. Sometimes you see players trying to do the, trying to execute that handoff, and they just kind of stick their bum out there. That was what the foul was about. Meantime. Netherlands will pick up a fifth foul. They got one more to give. Substitution made for Poland. As Oldana Manovic is out, and Szymborska is in. Kostanek, bullet pass down low. Szymborska, layup no good. Szymborska fighting for it. But she's tied up. So that should be Netherlands ball. So all that effort will not get Polska the possession. Instead, it's over to the Dutch. So if you're Netherlands, this game is still in reach. Good defense to break that up. Dreesen will not get a clean look. Could have more time in the shot clock. But uh, ends up forcing it up. Out of bounds, it'll go. If you're Poland here, you've got to be playing this game right now as though you don't have a five-point lead. I'd be playing it like 0-0. Zero, zero. That way you can continue to apply pressure. Bedfield call for a sixth. Netherlands foul. But it, I think a critical part, critical part of this game, and that 
Poland can maybe blow this game open if they put together some strong possessions. Netherlands have to do their best to prevent it. Meantime, a bank deposit from Kostarak. Beckville will try to respond to us. Beckville in off the glass. A 9-4 contest. Beckville out, Dreesen is now in. Manovic pulls up off the iron. Foul underneath. That, should, that will put Jim Borska on the line. That's the seventh foul. Two free throws coming up. Alexandra Jim Borska put her name on the map. With that silver medal. You might remember the heroics last year at the U23 uh, World Cup in that crazy fall away. Great uh, game winning call for my guy, Boss Rosendahl, as well. But that was against Germany to lift them to the quarterfinals. They went on to win silver. They got a bigger prize at stake out here. Oh, Jim Borska, hustling like Nipsey. RIP, 11 foe, Poland, poked away. Beckville to Dreesen. Dreesen, wide open, shooter, Bootstra. She strikes high. Nothing else. Marovic up top. She's dangerous with the rock. She's gone with the wind. Feel the breeze. Poland are feeling it right now with an eight point lead. Trying to hand the Netherlands their first loss here at the most critical stage. Zierborska, uh oh, that is gonna be an offensive foul for sure. Sosnowska, hands too high on setting that screen. That is the fifth. Number five on Poland. We got 4.43 to go. Six fouls now. So Poland have no more to give. It's either go hard or go home on this final day of play in Hong Kong. Single elimination. Dreesen gets some daylight. Oh, but the layup too much protein. An uncharacteristic game for the Netherlands, who have looked so strong up to this point. Kostadik, she will miss. They run out of time. Shot clock violation will give it back over to the Netherlands. They have got to find a way to end this stagnation offensively. Four points more than halfway through. Butstra. Gets called in a similar situation. She got called for an offensive foul in the same situation earlier. And that one's a repeating some of these mistakes. So far, it's contributed to them trailing by eight points. And Poland don't look like they're gonna slow up. Although they do throw that one away. The Seasons now is telling her teammates to calm down. No need to force anything. There's a warning for... So we get a coaching warning uh, for the Netherlands. As you know, there's no coaching allowed during the games. And from what I understand, you just, you just can't look at the coaches while they're coaching. Yuri, that would have been a big hit. 
Got a foul off ball. Got foul off ball. I believe whistled against the Netflix. We'll find out after this uh, media timeout. You are supporting a very important twist. There's the whole tunnel. A little bit of a shot to see Netherlands on their heels in this way. Understood that Poland was tough. But to play this well defensively and to build a significant lead against an undefeated Dutch team. We're going to see what the Orange Lions are made of in the final four minutes. It's an eight-point game pending. These two free throws could be up to a ten-point game. I believe that was Netherlands' eighth foul. The scoreboard is saying nine. Maybe I missed the foul. I guess so. Yeah, there was that offensive uh, foul. Siemborska. Feathery touch at the line. Nine-point game. Shreds the threads again. Ten point contest. It is 14 to 4. This game has got ugly as Medusa. That is the seventh foul on Poland, however. So now the Netherlands can start to trim into this 10 point deficit at the line. It's got to start somewhere. Sportster will cash that in. Second one is a miss. Look how high Monovic's got on that rebound. Good to see how she's recovered her career after the MCL injury. That one is kicked. That was the only thing to prevent what would have been probably an easy layup. So a fresh 12 for Poland to go back to work with. Sostanek is in, Marovic up top, Sosnowska starts it at the elbow with Bootstra. Playing some strong defense. Kostanek with Betfield now down, Kostanek launches the two ball. It is no good, Betfield will snag the rebound. Dreesen takes over, Dreesen. Cleared for firing, she missed it, and a whistle from uh, Poland's reaction, called on Poland. So their eighth stops the clock and gives Bootstra another opportunity at the line. Another couple opportunities. So Netherlands' sixth point comes with just over three minutes to play, make that seven. So they have managed to get a little bit into that deficit, but still significant at seven points. Monovic, right past Yorizma. Loose ball, ends up in Dreesen's hands. Dreesen will get that shorty to go. So a little back and forth between the two teams now. Sosnowska, call for the travel. So the Netherlands trying to do anything they can to shift the momentum now with 250 to go. That will not help. Travel. Travel is called. They've got to settle in. A lot of miscues for the Netherlands. And here come Poland. Siemborska. Can't get it to go. Now Bettenville wants to go to work. Bettenville. Shields for Dries in the shoe. And Netherlands looking like a completely different team from group play. Credit Poland's defense, but the miscues that have been made, and that's, that's all on the Netherlands at the moment. We got 2.20 to play. Sosnowska drops it off. Kostanek, easy as Sunday morning. 
16 to 8. Yoritsma. What in the world? So that shot had no chance. Another look at the connection with Poland's last bucket. Kostane, she's got that look in her eyes. Oh, she can see that one go the other way. Gets it back though and is unfazed. 17-8 Poland. Oh my goodness. Offensive foul in the Netherlands. That is the 10. No, no free throw because of the offensive foul. But the body language you see from the Netherlands, uh, they are stunned. They are stunned at this performance. And you got to do nothing but show love to Poland, too. Poland got a squad of killers over there. Actually, okay, actually, it wasn't offensive. I was wrong, so there are free throws here. My view was obstructed. Castane. Good like grandma's cookies. Constantin. Yes, ma'am. It is 19 to 8. This game is out of control like a frat party. And it's going to be Poland partying after this one. Or maybe not after this one. They'll still have one more game. I, I don't see the Netherlands coming back. They are fighting until the very end as Poland will pick up another foul. That's their ninth. But they got two points to go until this game is over with. Team Poland has two free throws. Netherlands. Bolstra will get Netherlands closer to double digits. Bolstra. She gets both. Bolstra gets them both to go. Buck 40 to play. A two ball would end it. One minute and a half. Jimborska coming around from the logo. Jimborska, stop and go, fall away. Tough shot, nope, touches nothing. Shot clock violation. Timeout on the floor. So Netherlands will need a barrage, barrage of twos. And even more help than that. If they want to come from behind and steal this one, you don't see it often. Time is not on their side. It has uh, been the least put together game from the Netherlands here in Hong Kong so far. An absolute shocker as we look at the top scores. You see Kostanek leading the way for Poland. Sian Borska right behind with five points. It'll be Netherlands ball, minute 27 to go. Dreesen up top, Betfield, that two would be big, and it's missed, Goritzma recovers. 19 to 11, Kostanek travels. So not exactly what Poland needs. They aren't exactly feeling threatened at the moment. We'll see what happens here with Dreesen and Betfield. Betfield, long attempt. No, Bonovic will look to use some clock here. They got nine seconds to shoot. Kostanek now with six. Bonovic sizing up the defense. That is blocked. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a second. That, they're saying shot clock violation. I'm not certain of that one. I think that might have gone before the horn. I, so that right on cue, Poland does challenge. But that was that was close. And I I think that that's gonna end up being a bucket. 
No, never mind. Challenge lost. I was wrong. I was wrong. This is why the officials are officials and I'm a commentator. <laughs> They are the professionals when it comes to uh, officiating this game called 3x3. Anyways, Netherlands ball. No bucket for Poland. Betfield, too strong off the back iron. 45 seconds left in this one. Sosnowska to Kostanek. Kostanek turns the corner, gets to the rim. She and Borska fight for the board. Ball out of bounds though. 36 ticks left. Eight point lead for Poland. This one's pretty much in the books. Dreesen swings it over. Bettville can't drop the bomb. So Netherlands will have to find a way to rid themselves of the bad taste in their mouth. But all hope isn't lost. They will play at the Utsunomiya OQT. Uh, that's coming up May the 3rd, and the last OQT, May 16th in Deverson. So they will have a couple of more, couple more attempts at their Olympic dream with the Netherlands. So it uh, it won't work out for them here in Hong Kong, not this time. But again, two more cracks at it. Our next two OQTs for the Netherlands. Goritzma shoots. By virtue of the double penalty, the possession will stay with the Orange Lions. Norcha to Bentonville with 12 seconds left. That one is a miss. Sosnowska has it cleared. And the final five seconds will tick off. Siemborska, the finishing touch. That will go. The official final. 20 to 12. How about Poland, y'all? It is Poland and Azerbaijan fighting for the ticket to party. What a performance. A blowout W for Team Poland. Netherlands suffer a shocker.